Not going to end well. Just keep your wits about you. Calm, Ivar. Me and Aver will take care of this. Sigurd, is there a problem? We'll go see Tomna. Just the two of us. Ivar and Uba will wait here. Better if Tomna thinks we've come alone. The truth is, I don't think any of us can stop Ivar from cleaving her head open. It's all he was spewing the whole way over here. Right. Shall we? We'll return shortly. A small fortune for whoever sent Tona to hell. I'll hold you to that. From what I overheard in Repton, the brothers had an arrangement with Tona. What happened? She's a mercenary. Uba used her for man and information. But that relationship soured now that Burgret is all but defeated. From what I heard, Tona has hunger for two things. Soft silver and a stern hunk. Neither of which earns you true loyalty. If she can't be trusted, what use is she? That is for us to find out. We may be able to satisfy her. And if we can't? Eva did tell you to bring your axe. And here they are, as expected. If she takes a liking to you, keep talking. She's more your type, I think. No, no. This is your challenge. Come now. Don't drag your I'll feet. Share of it. Sigurd, what brings you strolling into my camp this brisk day? I suspect you already know. Yes. The embers on the air betray you. And yet, if you are here talking to me, King Burgeret remains at large. And who are you, lovely dove? Want to perch your ass on my lap? That's not why I'm here. Where is King Burgeret? That is what you want. And what makes you think I have the slightest idea? We found letters. Records of trade. The two of you have a history. What can I say? The king pays well for my services. If only I could say the same for those two Ragnarsson clods. You're dealing with me now. And I want to know what you know. Name your price. Very well. I could use another cow. And you can cover the cost. Here's your silver. Mm, ripe as a plum, aren't you? So eager. Out with it. Burgred paid me to steer the Ragnarsons clear of two areas, Ledechestre and Templebrochfort. It was a hefty amount. If I were you, that's where I'd look. And that is all I know. Not more, not less. We are done here. Ledechestre and Templebroth Fort. Do you know these places? I don't, but the brothers will. I'll bring this news to them. Don't stay around here too long. We've got a king to catch. Sigurd's told us the news. Well done. Letterchester and Templebroth fought. What do you know about them? Hmm. Letterchester is a large village. And Templebroch, it's an old military fort. Not much else. 
Burkhardt could be at either one. We should check both. As soon as possible. And what do we do with Tona? I would bet the sweat off my sack she's writing to Borgred now, offering silver for a warning about us. Let me worry about that. We should get moving, Drinkit. I can take the fortress of Templebroch. I will join you, Sigurd. That leaves me Ledichester, then. All by my fucking lonesome. Bring a friend, brother. Maybe Eivor dares to be called that. Go on ahead. I'll catch up with all of you soon. Survey the area soon. Good timing. We would have stormed the place without you. What have you seen? 
Soldiers are plenty, wagons going in and out. That weasel Borgred is here, I'm sure of it. The bathhouse there and that church, see? I sent a scout to check them both. Should be back at any moment now. Did you see Uba and Sigurd in Templarbrach? No. And if Burkrid is hiding here, I won't have to. There is a lot we would not have to do if we stuck to killing kings. Thanks to my brother, now we are into making them. No small tension between you two. Thought you'd be more like-minded. You and Sigurd, you always see eye to eye? More often than not. You are still young. You live to my age and you will see. The closer you get, the greater the stink that rises. Time's up for your scout, I'd say. He's either dead or run off. Give him a chance. Can't risk them seeing us and Burkert slipping away again. You stay here and wait for your scout. I'm going in.
Quite a haul of goods they've hidden away. Crates full of food and supplies. Burkwood is not giving up without a fight. in Have you lost your mind? I feared you were one of them. Keep quiet. What are you doing here? I'm... 
I was looking for Burgred. You are Ivar's scout. I hoped I might find Burgred myself and talk him into surrendering. But he's not in Lederchester. How can you be sure? Leofrith passed this way with some men. I eavesdropped. It seems they're only stockpiling food here. But he did say something of interest. Gave orders to send more men to Burgred's wife, the Lady Arvelswith. She's in Templebloch. She would know where Burgred's hiding. Do you hear that? The sounds of battle, Eva. Let's let's get you out of here now. Where are you going? I know my way around. We'll go through the market. This way. Stay close to me. What do I do? Fight! Fight! Speak up. I... I don't think so. My God. I didn't want it to come to this. They would have killed you, Chilbert. You had no choice. Now don't move. I'll be back. Where is your king, Saxon? Where is he? Lord our Father, grant me salvation. <laughs> When does their god find the time to answer so much mumbling and whimpering? You are reckless, Ivar. Jailbird could have been killed. Who am I to stand in the light of a boy searching for his balls? Don't excuse yourself. You enjoy this too much. Stop. It wasn't Ivar who sent me. I sent myself. Have caution, boy. Until your father is crowned, you are Mercia's enemy, not its champion. You understand? I understand. Good. Now return to Repton and remain there until we call. Will you not stay, Wolfkist? There is no king, but we have corpses to loot. Burkrit's Lady Athelswith is in Templebroth. We're going to find out what she knows. <laughs> Take everything!